people make those claims that, you know, diesel's making a comeback. Diesel never left. It's always been here, but people took the focus and put it into four-year schools and tried to make careers from there. This has been a proven industry since the truck first came out. I go back to a world population that keeps expanding and a food source that we're trying to keep up with to feed that population. So a huge demand on that technician base more than ever. Truckers, as we know, are the backbone of America. Everything that we have in our home comes off of the truck. Everything that's in the stores comes off the truck. The diesel techs are the ones who work on the trucks and get them back on the road. They're an essential worker, 100%. Whenever COVID hit, our trucks didn't stop because our trucks didn't stop, our technicians didn't stop. So when everybody else was working from home and taking a break <laughs> during you know, COVID and things like that, our diesel techs were still working. We come to Wild Tech to look for quality technicians to work on our trucks. We work on everything from Peterbilt to Freightliner. In the egg industry, you can work on a skid steer one day, you can work on a sprayer the next day, or a combine. I mean, there's just a, such a diverse line of equipment that we can work on, and it really keeps it interesting for the technician. We've got enough young adults who want to get their hands dirty, want to make money quick and easy, and grow in a career that's successful for them. So diesel's right here for that. Jump right into diesel. WyoTech's a great school. They can come in here, graduate, and end up with one of these great employers before they graduate. It's a great situation. The advantages of the diesel training or industry here at WyoTech is we, we teach the basics. We don't specify one industry over the next. If you understand how to use the equipment and the basic tooling, you should be able to implement that in any type of industry you go into. There's all these different branches that people kind of forget about when they talk about diesel. You say diesel, they think semis, they think heavy equipment, they don't even consider shipping, they don't even consider power generation, construction, there's heavy equipment, there's mining, there's boats. The career opportunities after you graduate from WyoTech and diesel are unlimited. Across the entire United States, there's over 65,000 openings. So I've had students that have graduated here, went to Halliburton, and went to the South Pole because Raytheon is a division of Halliburton. So anywhere in the world you want to go with any education, diesel or automotive, you will have that opportunity. My favorite part about the diesel program here at Wild Tech is uh, you'll, you can come in here not knowing nothing and you'll leave with knowing everything. You have job security your entire life. You can work anywhere you want. You can do just about anything. Uh, you can get into AC and refrigeration or get into electrical, transmissions, engines, whatever you want. I'm laboring the wheels, tires, engines, everything about it, it's simple. It's fun. You fix this by pounding that. It works perfectly fine. I picked diesel because I first off love trucks. I love equipment. I love everything about the diesel engine compared to an auto engine. I've always been interested in this trade. I joined the diesel part because I really want to work on boats and all that when I go back home. There's plenty of areas that you can go into. It's all just whatever interests you. Going towards the oil field is what interests me. So I spend four years at a college where you could get a job. But come spend nine months and you for sure get a job before you leave school. I still have five and a half more weeks here and I already got a job waiting for me as soon as I get out of here. They told me Wild Tech was one of the best trade schools in the state, so I had to go to the best. <laughs>